Hey boys and girls, uh, I just got done installing the TriStar charge controller. Sorry for the mess, I was making batteries and cables. <clears throat> Here it is. And how oh, I hooked it up. I installed the switch here that brings power from positive of uh, 24 volt and this is the negative leg right there that goes directly to the negative of the charge controller the positive goes through this switch to the charge controller and then the charging line comes to this switch and goes to the battery so we have the feed from the charge controller to the batteries through a switch from the charge controller right now the batteries we're at 13.2 volts. I've been charging them last night through the jumper cable by the upper bank of the my 24 volt system. I'm gonna turn the charge controller on. Are you searching? Because it's not getting any voltage and thinks it's night, it reads the battery voltage. At 13.2, which is close to what my meter is reading. So I'm gonna turn the power from the batteries from the 24 volt bank and see if it will wake up or not. There we go. Okay, jump to the absorb you see jump to 14.3 volts that is the charge as going to the batteries the batteries are at 14.1 volts getting 16.2 amps the batteries so I'm gonna try equalize these batteries because they've been sitting for a while I guess I didn't hold it up enough hold on do it again okay. now we went to equalize mode you see it's equalizing now 14.6 volt at 17 17 and a half amps I want to see how many amps is going actually to the batteries. Okay, it's drawing 9 amps from the battery bank. Let's 
see how much is it sending in. 16.1 uh, pretty close that's the whole setup there guys and it's working now I have to install the relay on the Midnight Classic So, uh, once it hits the absorb mode, it will activate the relay that will activate the TriStar. Okay, folks, hope you enjoyed it. Signing off. Bye.